I like it here, it's nice. Hi. <laughs> Wouldn't it be nice? Hi. Are you the coach? <laughs> Send a message where are we? Surprise, surprise, nobody's messaged back. Well, we were here, whatever we got it. So <sighs> Welcome to the dome. Oh, I have never used this camera inside the dome, and the colors are so good. They're so good. Look, happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. We had costumes semi-planned, but uh, plans fell through. Although, we were talking in our group chat earlier yesterday and we said, yeah, yeah, tomorrow we'll come up with a costume, we'll figure it out. Sure enough, Zach Kevion from Workout Wednesday, he uh, chimed in, he said, yeah, absolutely. Show up right now, none of us are wearing costume. Zach's holding a big floaty donut and he's wearing a, a magic jersey, got the headband on, fully committed. So funny. What is it? <laughs> okay. Okay, we'll ask the crowd. Yeah, let's ask the crowd. Give Comment down below what you think Zachy's costume is. Well, they're gonna know. They're all smart. Are they? You. Are they gonna know? Basketball player Simpson. <laughs> 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 Guys, thanks for letting me know. It's freaking red top, black bottom. Already feels like indoor season has started. This is so sweet. Watch Levy on his next one after his last turtle. He's just gonna stick there with his arm like this for a bit. Gotta keep it strong. Watch, 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 watch. There's a justification for why I do that. I punch this arm up to get this foot down. <laughs> <laughs> You burned it in? Still recording? The calves are getting real tight. These are fun though. I haven't done a hurdle drill in three and four months maybe. Let's go tell them
I made a move. But I'm gonna move very last second. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> do I just not move and <laughs> see if he <laughs> back in the pole vaults. Good to be back at the dome, vault. Not you know? at all. Literally busting. Okay, it sucks to be back at the track. dome, but honestly, tell him how good is it to vault with no wind. Fact. Fact. And my hands are already Pole vault. Indoor pole vault is where we shine, boys. Oh yeah. My this hands already like, smell like freaking rotten mouse. This is really good stuff. <laughs> <laughs> this is really good stuff. <laughs> I wonder how much mouse poop is under these mats right now. Also, I grabbed the pole with no tape on the top. Idiot, Maddie. You don't cap that pole stop for time. All right, I'll move, I'll move the hurdles out of the way so you guys have a little bit of time. A little space. First, first line is just walking. One, two, three, four, five, six, drop. You're recording? You're recording, guys? Pole vault trust. For the first time in, first time in a few months. Bam! <sighs> Next one is the same thing, except now we're going to go one, two, three into a run into a plant. Yeah, so it's just instead of just marching it out, now we're going to have a little bit of a. Show yep. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. <laughs> yeah Pull approach. Pull approach. <laughs> but you don't have to have so much high knees on the first three. Like we can just, this is what I'm looking for. Okay, so six steps. I like it here, it's nice. Hi. Wouldn't it be nice? Hi. Are you the coach? Ah, Jimbo just made a fool of himself in front of a new athlete. Too good. We're doing sand drills. Okay, so we have 11 runs, a bunch of 100s, a bunch of 200s. Um, starting with the hundos, I think we have like three of them, a bit of rest. And then we have two hundos, three of them, a bit of rest. And then we go back to one hundos, we do three of them and a bit of rest. I think it's like two minutes and three minutes. Uh, two for the lower, three for the uh, for the higher. And uh, two by 200 to finish with one minute rest in between them. So it starts to like, I think it's, Jimbo's still trying to do this diminishing rest thing. Um, also in here, the atmosphere is a lot different. It's a lot drier. Uh, but it's a lot warmer as well, which is very nice considering uh, we live in Canada and uh, yeah. By the way, if you're new here and you didn't know, we have a 400 meter track indoors in the city of Ottawa, Ontario, Canada. So if you love track and field and you hate winter, like winter, you come here. That's it though. That's it. That was around 16.5 for the last kiddos. It's perfect. That's exactly what I need. I was just telling everybody, or saying to everybody, wouldn't it be amazing if it was like this? All the time. No soccer players. No soccer balls bouncing over everywhere. No soccer players waiting to get on the soccer field, kicking balls around. 
Got the track hour to ourselves. Somebody's got to win the lottery and buy us a track. Can you imagine if this was your high school gym? Some pretty lucky kiddos in this area. I'd like to point out once again that there's nobody on the track right now. Eight runs down, one one hundo to go, and then we have uh, two two hundreds left. That's it. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. This is no problem. Good little, <coughs> <coughs> good little wrap up to that workout. We finished off with. Um, can can stuff like that and we did a bunch of abs and of course Jimbo said yeah you guys look like you're tired nah never always ask for more abs and when he offers you rest don't take rest don't take it. <laughs>